What's up YouTube? So today I went fishing and I didn't catch a whole lot of fish. I actually only caught one and it's like a million bajillion degrees outside. So I figured I would make a video on how to use a Texas rig, how to rig it, where to throw it, uh, size of the hook compared to the bait you want to use, and everything about a Texas rig that I know and that the beginning angler would not know. So, a Texas rig is a very versatile bait. You can throw it up in the grass or you can throw it, you can peg it and flip it up into the grass or you can throw it out deep when it's 110 outside and still get that bite. So, first thing you're gonna put on your line when you're rigging a Texas rig a Texas rig, you can use any size line. I use 12 to 17 pound mono. Uh, most of the time it's strand mono. Um, I have weights. The weight that I normally use is about a 3 8 ounce uh, lead weight. And sometimes if I want it to go to the bottom really fast or I'm flipping mats, I needed to go through the mat. I get out this big one ouncer. But, yeah. So, um, where to throw it? You can pretty well throw it anywhere. You can flip it in the grass. You can throw it on trees. Uh, you can throw it, go just chuck and wind it on deep cover. Anywhere that there's cover, basically but not too much cover that it's gonna get stuck, you know, just like every other bait. Um, now, for hooks, I like to use some Eagle Claw Laser Sharp 3 uh EWG worm hook. I'll show you guys what that looks like. Uh, yeah, here. Little, little extra wide gap hook. Um, you don't want a hook that is way too big for your soft plastic. So what I mean by that is, say I'm fishing with this little Cinco, right? So what you wanted, or this is also, I'll show you also how to rig a Texas tree. So, um, you're gonna go down like this. I don't know, can y'all see that there? I only went down to where the hook has it first bend at, look. To the first bend. And then you pop it back through. You feed it around like this. And then you go all the way around like that. Okay, so there's that. So then you're gonna bend your arm. And that's how a Texas shirt is gonna look. Now, you can either put a sinker on top, you don't have to. Um, there's a there's a weight or there's a weightless sinko. I could go and tie this on a rod right now and probably catch a fish. Except it's hundred and four outside. Anyway, um yeah. So that's how to rig it. Um, yeah, what else? You could probably use. Um, you can you can use any bait except maybe like drop shot baits. There's some drop shot baits that are too skinny. You can't rig, but like. Uh, you guys have seen me Texas rig a brush hog quite a few times. A little, little brush hog. Um, you can also Texas rig a little trigger crawl. Trigger crawl is a good little bait. Little, little 
trigger crawl. You can Texas rig them. Um, yeah. That is my segment on um, how to rig a Texas rig and the, all my Texas rig tactics. Um, if you guys have any questions, drop a comment down below. Go check out Grambling Bait Co. Um, and I will see you guys on another episode of McDonald Outdoors.